I clean up really well there, don't I? What's up, everybody? It's Smiley, and it's that time. Um, Maker Geeks Geek Box. Last week, I did a, a quick little video, so that I thought I would have the Geek Box video up last week, but it didn't arrive until uh, today. Um, I received notice, and then it didn't ship until three days later, which was a little weird, but not completely new for subscription boxes. I get the Loot Crate box and some uh, they'll notify me that, yeah, your, your order's processing and then it doesn't ship out for another week and it takes another week to get here. So it's not, not a big deal, but uh, it actually worked out because I was in a car accident on Thursday last week and I've been dealing with insurance and rental car and pain and uh, I'm fine my Jeep is most likely totaled um, rear-ended at a stoplight by a stolen minivan seven total vehicles involved three of us went to the hospital and ambulances and yeah just a, a whole bunch of fun so I, I haven't done a whole lot of printing or anything so my ANA A8 assembly may not start until next week uh, I want to build a new little table i've got some mdf and plywood and two by fours that i'm going to build like a four foot little bench to to set it on because this isn't very big anyway to the main event dun, da, da, da. and i have no idea if this is the top or bottom because the mailing label was on the side and well it looks like i got the top what do we got Ooh, wow uh-oh bearings uh, what do we got? Summer is on a roll, and so is the July 3D Geek Box. July, nothing really marks summer. like For me, like the month of July, temps are finally up. Fourth of July barbecue, blah, 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 blah. What do we got? We got two kilos of Maker Series PLA. Four 608ZZ bearings for a new spool holder. One diagonal cutter, so flush cutters, and we need to put our spools somewhere, so we have the thing of the month is thingiverse.com forward slash thing 2047554, which is, well, it comes from filamentary on Thingiverse, and it looks like it's a, an adjustable spool holder. I'll link it up here in the, the thing, but let's take a look at this and see, we, it looks like we got, we got a sticker, yep, a sticker for the 3D Geek Box, which I probably should start sticking these on something. Um, for, what do we got here? ABEX 7, 608ZZ bearings. Let's see if they're, whoop. And yeah, they are, they're grease filled, bare, barely spin, or well, they don't spin freely, but they, they barely spin as it is. So that's, whoa, that's those. And what do we got here? A Plato model 170 shears. It says use safety glasses and it can cut maximum 0 0.040 one millimeter diameter copper copper wire which is good but flush cutters are always a good thing i have one pair of broken ones that i still kind of use i have one pair of good ones and then i now i have these which feel like they're about in the middle um, so let's stick that back in here and see what the pla we get is move that back there set that there more of our fancy packaging and we have urban fossil maker series pla which i don't know that's kind of a 
grayish green. I mean, it's not quite, it's like army green, but a little more gray and a little lighter. Um, and yeah, I, I noticed this with the, the grab bag box that I got that they're no longer shipping their PLA in resealable bags, which I, granted, I have a ton of them, and you can fit these spools in a gallon size um, freezer bag from the grocery store. But that was one of the things I really liked. That they shipped these in their own heavy duty resealable bags and not these little thin, flimsy ones. And uh, that's a little disappointing. And what do we got for our other color? We have Dark as Night Black, which is black. So we'll see what that ends up looking like. So we'll set that there and throw that there. And as usual, well, not as usual, but what I plan on doing now is continuing uh, doing the unboxing for this month and then do a review of last month's which last month's filament was what did we get last month i don't even remember what we got oh last i, I remember what we got last month um because i got more of it we got the racy red and sun punch, sun punch yellow pla which i also got in the grab bags i have not printed any with the red um I was planning on it, but my accident kind of set that back because I was printing in the previous month's orange to get the uh, finish all the, the modification parts for my new A A8. But this is the, the old bag. You can see it's heavier material and it's got a, a reclosable. And this I didn't tear very well, but it's got a built in zipper. These new bags do not have that, which is pretty disappointing. Um, but anyway, this is what we got with the last month. And the yellow I did print quite a bit with. So we have, my favorite things here are the stackable storage boxes, which um, are just awesome because you can print them and stack them and I have, probably a dozen of these now all in different colors that I store stuff in and I also shrunk them down this is 50% size that uh, I print two at once one of these at once but these you can print the divider the divider doesn't really fit very well the divider fits great in these um, I didn't print one in the yellow but uh, that's 50% I also have a 75% scale version of this but i'm having problems with the the wall thickness i've got to tweak the the walls a little bit um i also did i don't know where the the little pin is the sanding tool in the yellow which is about a quarter inch wide um i don't know what is that like five four mils wide um this is also 50 percent length because I, I don't need a huge sanding block. I have large sanding blocks. I need small ones. So this is great because I can change the sandpaper. And I did different colors um, of this. I've got a thicker one that's in the orange. I've got this that's in the, the yellow. Uh, I'm gonna do a, a couple more different colors, maybe in the black and the, the gray um, for different grits. So I know which grit I have on, on what. I did the <laughs> lego flower this is i don't even know what percent scale it is it's there's a, a big version <laughs> that's like this um this is like the hundred percent size that i've only printed out one of these so far but you know this is i think 25 percent size this is the tiger stripe orange this is i think this is inland uh, red PLA and then this is the Sun Punch yellow and this is the translucent crystal series green PLA which for some reason kind of printed horribly I think I was printing this when I was having my adhesion issues that turned out to be a, a temperature thing um, 
I also did an extruding sign. Um, this is small, but it was kind of a, a little fun thing. The black is paint. I just painted it on. There's a little smudge down there, but it's just black acrylic. Um, thin, there's no holes or anything, but uh, double-sided tape or something will just stick that on there, and that's kind of fun. But I get this out of the way. The project for the month was a tool holder, which I printed in the orange, and this is the tool holder. Um, it took quite a while to actually print, and there's a, a, some strings and a few things, and it kind of stuck to my bed a little bit in one spot. Um, but overall, it, it came out good. I'll have to put a picture up. I ended, I didn't know if this was going to finish um, because I thought I was going to run out of filament. I ended up with about four inches or so of filament hanging out of the end of the extruder um, that I'll try and put a pick up here. If not, oh well, sorry suckers. I put it, I think I put it on my Facebook page. Anyway, um, I haven't put any tools in this. I don't even know where the tools are supposed to go. I could probably look and and see, but I'm imagining that like flush cutters go in there or something, screwdrivers go in there and maybe knife there. I don't know. I know calipers go in the front, um, but yeah, that's the the tool holder. Um, there's a couple small holes. I don't know if you can even see them down here. Um, that one's kind of full and that one, I don't think anything can go in. Um, I might get my, my little thumb drill and, and drill those out. Um, I guess they're for um, hex wrenches, Allen keys, um, glue sticks or screwdrivers. or I don't know if these are meant for SD cards or whatever, but this is awfully close to here to actually put in there. Um, but we'll see, yeah, I, I don't know if I'll use it or not, because I tend to, to use, like, cups to hold stuff. Um, but, yeah, that's pretty much it for this month. Um, like I said, my ANET A8 build will be coming up soon. I will be doing a review of Inland PLA. I've printed a bunch in blue and red. Um... I think those are the only, well, I, I printed a little bit in pink, but not, well, that was just spinners, and I don't think I have any more of those left. I think I sold them all. But anyway, that's that. Uh, thanks, everybody, for tuning in. Um, give me a like. Give me a subscribe. Follow me on Facebook at facebook.com slash smiley3d. I now have a Twitch channel. It is twitch.tv. Um, I, I'm not even sure how you get to the URL. I don't have anything on it yet. I just set it up, but that's where I'm going to be doing my ANET A8 build. Um, it is 3D Smiley, because Smiley 3D was already taken, I, I guess. Um, so, what else I got? I've got my website, smiley3d.com. Nothing's really up there. I am putting up a user forum that uh, I've got it installed. I just don't have it configured or linked from the main page yet. And a store, which is also installed, just nothing's really there yet to, to buy. But with the forum, I want to have uh, kind of a maker's forum where everybody can discuss um, printers, CNC machines, uh, finishing, painting. Um, I do woodworking, um, working on building a couple guitars, and that's actually why I bought the 3D printer was to print bobbins for guitar humbuckers. And now I'm going to build myself a bobbin winder. Um, I have all the parts. I just don't have any of the, the like the actual pickup parts yet. But that is about it and i just realized i should probably actually be doing all this talking while you're seeing me but da 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 too late now see ya